In industrial development, SOC projects are essential, and damaging the natural environment with concrete or other materials used for construction is still considered inevitable. Corrugated multi-plate structures are the solution to such environmental damage. They are eco-friendly, beautiful, and do not damage the environment. Now, let us show you everything about corrugated multi-plate structures. First, let's have a look at past projects in Korea. On roads, a total of 3,767 projects, including 3,030 passages and waterways, 550 small bridges, 150 eco-tunnels. On railways, a total of 108 projects, including 33 passages and waterways, 6 small bridges, 7 eco-tunnels, and 62 Natum tunnel portal. On complex, a total of 193 projects, including 43 passages and waterways, 120 small bridges, and 30 eco-tunnels. On golf courses, a total of 40 projects, including 20 passages and waterways, 10 small bridges, and 10 eco-tunnels. That's 4,340 design cases and 1,800 construction cases. Overseas, starting with Inner Mongolia, Canada, Australia, Vietnam, and India, the achievements and demand is increasing exponentially. When the foundation is laid and the corrugated multi-plates are installed, backfill is carried out by compaction. Lateral earth pressure occurs in this process, and passive earth pressure occurs on the sides during compaction of the upper part, allowing backfill soil to play a structural role. When paving is complete, the service load comes only from the axial force, making it a highly efficient structure. Corrugated multi-plate structures are superior to concrete structures in many ways. Forming uniform ridges on virgin plates gives them better load carrying capacity and up to 30 times more rigidity. Zinc or aluminum plated steel plates give superior corrosion resistance, able to withstand more than 100 years. Storage and transportation is easy as they can be stacked on top of one another. They are lighter than concrete structures, making them easy to transport. The bolt assembly method also shortens construction period. For a 30 meter structure, the construction is finished within 12 days using corrugated multi-plates. But reinforced concrete needs 30 days for assembly, installation of support posts, etc. Especially for large scale construction, corrugated multi-structures can be built in 40% of the time it takes to build a concrete one allowing for the structure to be open earlier and resulting in extra profit. The biggest advantage of corrugated multi-structures is that they can be built without support posts and minimize traffic. Construction cost is reduced for the above reasons, resulting in an excellent economic efficiency. These eco-friendly structures allow for forests or parks to be built around them, contributing to environmental conservation and improved public health. Corrugated multi-plate structures utilize the dynamic characteristics of arches to maximize section profiling efficiency, making it applicable to various projects such as passages and waterway of road and railway, tunnels and bridges. Applied to 855 sites including the Jeonju Gwangyang Highway, passage conduits don't require support posts, allowing traffic during construction and resulting in reduced cost and public complaints. Passage conduits can be built at 75% of the cost of reinforced concrete structures. When applied to waterway conduits, they are more aesthetically pleasing than reinforced concrete and allow up to 25% more space for the water, facilitating an unhindered flow even during floods. Waterway conduits can be built at 85% of the cost of reinforced concrete construction. Applied to 43 sites, including this whole Chuncheon Highway, Eco-tunnels can be applied to spans measuring up to 23 meters. They are aesthetically pleasing and easy to maintain quality. In the portal of Beveled End, aesthetics was improved with a canopy to control brightness. In Headwall also, canopies, marble finish, 
and stone tiles were used in the same way as in environmental restoration. Eco tunnels can be built at 65% of the cost of reinforced concrete construction. For cut and cover tunnel at the portal of Natum Tunnels, the structure can be built and the trench covered quickly. It stabilizes soil surface and minimizes temporary structure of tunnel portal, shortening construction time and reducing cost. It can be built at 65% of the cost of reinforced concrete tunnels. Currently applied to 410 sites, small bridges can be applied to spans measuring up to 23 meters. Its superior corrosion resistance makes it an excellent alternative for reinforced concrete rigid frame bridges. Fast assembly reduces the construction period by more than 50% compared to reinforced concrete and it has been applied to 16 flood recovery sites in Pyeongchang. Small bridges can be built at 60% of the construction cost of reinforced concrete rigid frame bridges. Applied to 37 sites, including the Kyungi Railway, which connects South Korea to North Korea, the usability was improved with a curved surface. Soil steel structures of railway can be built at 70% of the cost of reinforced concrete. As such, corrugated multi-plate structures have 60% to 85% higher economic efficiency compared to ferro-concrete structures. To build a corrugated multi-plate structure, the basic concrete foundation is laid, then the channel and anchor are installed. Corrugated multi-plates are assembled starting with the foundation toward the structure, ensuring symmetry of both sides. After waterproofing to prevent leakage, backfill is done by compaction to 20 to 30 centimeters. It is important to secure sufficient compaction. Care must be taken not to cause eccentric load. When installing road or railway crossing structure, the corrugated multi-plates can be pre-assembled, then lifted with a crane for installation. It is especially advantageous for sites requiring stability and rapidity. When reinforcing old bridges or conduits, the original structure is not dismantled, but instead corrugated multi-plates are installed in place, then backfilled. This method eliminates the cost of dismantlement, waste removal, and detour passage during construction. The corrugated multi-plates can be assembled on site, then pushed into place for a quick construction, minimizing traffic disruptions and public complaint. For temporary roads or bridges, Three to seven millimeter lightweight corrugated multi-plates are assembled on site with simple bolts, minimizing construction period and cost. Especially for flood recovery, lightweight equipment can be used to restore lost bridges or roads in one to two days, allowing for a timely delivery of relief supplies and restoration equipment. This is an environmentally friendly method where the structures can be recycled after they have fulfilled their duties. Initial measurements are taken after assembly and the structure is checked for displacement by taking measurements during backfill. Even after completion, the structure is maintained continuously to ensure stability.